All right, so uh, this video is going to be on the whole uh, Ben Shapiro walking out of an interview, uh, and I'm and I'm going to talk about a couple of other things that and and when I I'm I'm going to talk about a couple of other things on and, and it on the face of it we can already say that that was a very immature thing to say. What do you say? I'm I'm more popular than you. what? You know, I, I can say that, and I and I know the leftists are what they're doing is they're using to say, well, see, see, you should never listen to anything he says. You should never listen to anything he says because because of this one bad interview. And everyone can have a bad interview. Everyone can be un, uh, um, unprepared to take whatever and have a bad so or a bad debate, which it should just be an interview. But obviously, it was it's gonna. Let's be honest here. Every every interviewer now we've seen from Jordan Peterson and things like that that it's a debate, of course, but and not an interview. You would think that they would just want to now, but so it was terrible that he did that. I can't believe he 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 did that. That was a, you know, and and I kind of already had a feeling that he thinks that way, and um, that he thinks that way because. It, it, even though it's a joke saying my wife is a doctor, I, it, it, he puts it out like that's like, and it is something to be proud of, but like, it is like he's better. And that, that's the way I feel. That he puts it out there like it's a ha ha situation, which, hey, that's great, man, that your, your wife's got that going on. That's awesome. Um, the one time I, I brought it up in a previous video, and, and there was a young lady that talked about him coming to her school. And, um, and talking about you know more conservative principles, and I, I, I'll have to if I can find that at some point, I'll I'll put it in this video. But I guarantee it's going to be hard. But when he said uh, he in that, her, his response to that was, "I'd have to see how much I'm making in this." I'm like, "Well, wait, what?" If you and I, I get it, I get that. But it's it's you know wait what uh, it, that rubbed me the wrong way, and that actually slowed me down a whole lot. You know, uh, 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 um, uh, as far as kind of being one of his supporters, and um, so I, I, I didn't like that that he said that, and I didn't like that he kind of puts it when he talks about uh, stuff like uh, he's a virgin, but he was a virgin until he was married. I get it. That's that's awesome, man. That's something. But it, it, when you put it out there like I'm better because of it, I'm better than you. Or I'm, I'm someone to look up to. Hey, man, people make mistakes. That's great that you were able to keep that, and and you and your and your and your wife share something like that. That's freaking awesome. I get it. But that's also something we can never come back from. So, ha ha, you can never get your virginity back and have this same thing that me and my wife did, that my wife and I did. But ha ha, and I, you know. But okay, sit all that aside. I think he could have held his own. I can't believe he just didn't say, you know, you know, I, I made some stupid tweets or whatever. And whatever the guy was, was saying to him. And, you know, I hey, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But to get up and say I'm more popular than... Come on, man. That's... That's... What? That's my problem with it. Forget... Even if a person loses a debate. Forget that. That's my problem with you. So... In all that, I, I, I've actually unfollowed him and for not about losing a debate or something like that. I've unfollowed him and I've unfollowed a lot of other people, not just him. Because at this point, we need to stop looking up to people like him to make our arguments for us. Because a lot of people are doing it. The left is doing it with their champions. You're like your champion, you know. You're, the left is doing. We need to start getting educated ourselves and making these blue. Che we, we need to stop having these blue check marks talk for us. I've unfollowed everyone on my. Uh, I'm, I'm and I've, I, I. I need to go back in there. I've, I've unfollowed a lot of people. I come unfollow every blue check mark. I'm, I'm going to just unfollow at this point. As far as a person, and I'm going to start giving my opinion on news articles and things, and I think people need to stop because a lot of times these blue check marks don't interact with no, with us normal people with no blue check marks anyway. They only interact with each other, and that screams elitism. They're elite. They they have the blue check marks, so he doesn't, you know, 
a lot of times Ben Shapiro and a lot of these people, they don't interact with people that are that are not that are not on their level, quote unquote. And my thing is, is that the whole thing is what he was talking about the right side of history with this book. Fine. There's a lot of things to to uh, uh, argue there, but my main problem with with books and people like him and put out the people that put out there's things to argue and we don't have to when he was talking about judeo-christian values hey you know what i don't give a crap about any of that do we put women do we stone women for being raped in this country i don't give a damn about you judeo-christian and and influences and crap like that i don't care and and the reason we're like that i don't give a crap about that do we do that are we better than other countries in things I don't give a damn why we are and how we got there. The thing is, is we are there. We're better than a whole lot of other countries. So I, you know, like I said, to sit back and you, you don't, there doesn't have to be any in-depth things. When people say trans women aren't women, they, they, there's no deep thinking there. And I don't need someone like Ben Shapiro or any other person to make a simple, a very, very simple argument on that. And it, it, it's not, it, like I've said before in previous videos, it's like arguing religion on the Bible with a person that doesn't believe in the Bible. At that point, at that, if a person says, look, I don't believe in the Bible, and you're arguing religion, whatever, God, this and that, and one person, if we can't believe in the Bible, then we're done talking. We'll talk about something else. We'll talk about the weather. I don't give a crap. So if you're dealing with the person that says trans women aren't women, I don't need to destroy, or a person says trans women are women, I don't need to destroy or find biology or find different ways to quote unquote destroy someone on that trans women are not women men are men women are women so i'm going a lot of different places with this video but i'm saying we got to have some things that are just going to be you know what they are you know it, 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 it is what it is trans women aren't women there it is Men and women are different. It is what it is. I don't need a biologist to tell me that on average men are stronger than women and on average men are taller than women. I don't need to, I don't need, I don't need there to, to, to anyone to tell me any of these things. So I think we almost need to boil it down to just things that are very, very simple. Boil it down to things that are very, very simple. Is, is, is a, a lot, there are some gray areas I understand that but a lot of things are just black and white and that's where we need to go so like I said with the whole thing with getting getting information and listening to the Daily Wire or listening to NPR or, or, or not or you know certain not NPR but just certain certain news agencies and listening to Sam Cedar and all these people I, I, you know the Young Turks the uh, the Jimmy Dore show, show all that crap people need to stop listening to stuff like that I don't give a damn if it's left wing or right wing people need to stop listening to things like that and just say you know I'm going to listen and we're going to have a conversation on the rock bottom issues and that'll be it before this, this goes on too long that's my that that's all I was trying to say in this. The, him walking out of an interview and and that 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 turned me. It, it was not. You know what? Walking out of almost walking out of an interview. That that that's a that's a B move. Of course, we know what the B is. That's a B move. But you know what? The, I, I I can take that before I can take him saying he's better or he's more popular. Because at that point, if he thinks that about him, he thinks that about me. And he's just, and to me, he's just another elite that thinks he's better than me. So that's it. Comment, like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.